guys, welcome back to my channel and a Merry Christmas! Today is Christmas morning and I actually woke up and everything's just covered in snow. There's like at least 10 centimeters of snow outside and it was like the best way to wake up on Christmas morning. As you can tell from the title of this video, this is a what I got for Christmas video and that is why I'm hanging out in my pajamas today, make it a little bit more casual and more festive. Um, I love filming these videos, I think they're so much fun and I love watching them. They're easily my favorite videos to watch. So if you filmed the what I got for Christmas video, let me know in the comments below because I will 100% watch it. I'll probably spend the next few days just kind of watching what I got for Christmas videos. Um, anyway, I don't want to make this intro too long, so I'm just going to go ahead and get started. I got some amazing gifts this year, and I just feel so blessed and grateful. So I really want to show you guys everything that I got. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and get started. Um, so the first thing that I got, you guys probably already saw on my Instagram stories. Um, and it was from my friend Adrian, and she got me the most beautiful vintage dress. It looks like this. It is cream lace, and it has all these little buttons and like puff sleeves. Like, look at how beautiful these little light pink buttons are. It just, it looks stunning. Um, and when she gave it to me, like something like was in my head. And I'm like, what does this remind me of? Like I couldn't really pinpoint it. And then I realized that it reminded me of Sharon Tate's wedding dress. It has a very similar silhouette, and her dress has buttons like this as well. But it's on the back um, either way it reminded me of that so I like that makes me love it like even more so thank you so much Adrian if you're watching this I love it so much my friend Michaela actually drew some illustrations and sent them to me yesterday and that was so sweet of her so thank you so much Michaela if you're watching this and my cousin actually he's um, turning 14 and he with his own money got me some hair clips and these little pearl hair clips and I thought that was so sweet so I really like this I'm gonna make sure to wear these like in the next couple of days um, and then for my aunt and my uncle they got me a I think it's a monocular is the proper term. It's like a binocular, but like one. So like monocular, I think is the proper term. So it looks like this. It is like gold and it has black leather on it. And then it extends. I need to find some friends that have boats, you know, so I can take this out. Um, but I just think it's so cool. And I love the gold color on it. I think that's so beautiful. And the little black leather on it really really cool so thank you so much i'm like so excited for this like it's so random but i'm like so excited honestly oh. and then for my sister she actually ended up getting me two gifts and i was so surprised first thing that she got me is this blow dryer and it is a special edition remington blow dryer that has like a vintage style to it i've actually always wanted a vintage hair dryer but i'm too scared to like get because of the cables and the wiring and everything like i don't trust it so she actually ended up finding this one that is retro looking it was like a limited edition thing so i'm gonna take it out of the box so you guys can see it's like baby pink which is beautiful look at that oh my god is this not the cutest thing ever look at it i love this color i think this is like stunning it is so cute. I'm obsessed. Like, absolutely obsessed. The second thing that she got me is going to come with a little bit of a story time because I was eyeing something on Etsy for a few weeks and I was kind of like back and forth on if I should buy it or not. And I kept showing it to her and I'm like, should I buy it? Should I not buy it? Um, and then I just kept thinking about it. And then one day I went on my Etsy, like, save for later and it was gone. And I remember talking to my sister and being like, oh my god, it's gone. Somebody bought it. Like, I'm so sad. And then I was looking for, like, something similar, but I couldn't really find what I was looking for. She actually ended up buying it for me and it was a huge surprise because we finished opening all our presents and then I came upstairs bringing all my stuff up here so I could film this video um, and then on top of my bed there's this huge box so I like freak out obviously and then I like open it and it was actually the item that I wanted and I'm so happy I'm gonna show you guys it is a vintage vanity like a travel vanity case it is so beautiful so it has like this um, sorry this is the tag from the Etsy shop the Etsy shop is Mercy Claudie I'll put it up here somewhere. Um, I am so excited. So it looks like this. It has a brown case. And then it opens up like this. And it looks like this here. It's supposed to be a mirror, but it's like all wrapped up. And then it has all of these pieces here. It has all the paper. I haven't really taken anything apart yet, but like... I am so excited and it is like dead stock like it still has like the original tax so it's never been used which is like really really exciting it is in perfect like immaculate condition I'm so excited to like open it up and like look at all the little pieces and everything I know one of the pieces is loose in here because it didn't fit with all the packaging so I'll show you guys that piece so this one is kind of like a little perfume bottle thing I'm it's like all glass like I'm so excited you guys have no idea I remember looking at this on my computer when my dad was kind of like passing by and he was like that looks like something somebody in the Titanic would bring and I'm like now I want it even more um it is vintage from I think it said like 1950s or 1960s it's probably 1960s um but I'm just like obsessed with it I think it is stunning and I was just so surprised so I really really love it so thank you so much Marianne if you're watching this you're probably not but like that's fine um thank you 
Now moving on to the stuff my parents got me. My parents were so sweet. They got me so many amazing presents this year. Um, the first thing that I got is this like vintage style hat. It's not vintage, but um, it does kind of have that vintage kind of look to it. This is actually the same hat that I wore to Dundurn Castle, but this is the black version, which is perfect because I feel like I'm going to be end up wearing black more than I would blue. It is just so cute. Like, oh my gosh, you guys. It is just everything. It does have like a little clip on the inside so you can actually like put it on your hair. You guys will be seeing this like all over my Instagram whenever I'm allowed to leave my house because of the lockdown. But my parents also got me some candy. Um, so Bunch of Crunch is a candy that we usually get when we go to the States because here in Canada they actually don't sell it anywhere. So I don't even know where she found this. But um, yeah, really excited. I love this chocolate. It's so good. And I wish they sold it here in Canada, but they don't. But my sister and I are like obsessed with this. Um, and then my mom also got me some crispy M&Ms, which are so hard to find. Ever since they came up with like the brownie one, it's really, really hard to actually find this one. And it is like the best M&M, in my opinion. I think it's like the best one. So really, really excited to have some treats. And chocolate is always nice at Christmas time, you know what I mean? They also got me my perfume my everyday perfume which is coco mademoiselle and i have been like trying not to use my perfume because it's been running out and i didn't want to spend the money to buy it now that i have whatever's left on my little bottle i'm just gonna like drown myself in it because i haven't used it in so long um but yeah really excited to finally have a new bottle they also got me this really really exciting present and i feel like you guys will probably can tell what this is already because i've been talking about it on my channel for pretty much since november i think um and i finally got one i'm so excited it is a flower press it looks like this it is like has my name engraved in it and it has all of these like flowers on it and it says Carolina's flower press it is stunning I'm so excited I love this so much and I feel like this is a really unique gift I feel like a lot of people might not ask for a flower press it might just be me but if you guys are interested in any videos relating to like flower pressing or like flowers in general let me know in the comments below because I would actually love to incorporate that into my channel they also got me a pair of shoes and I am in dire need of shoes I feel like I rarely buy shoes because I do most to my shopping at like thrift stores or vintage stores and I don't buy secondhand shoes so I rarely spend the money to actually buy shoes um so they actually got me a new pair of shoes which I know I'm gonna be using like non-stop and they look like this they are black and then they have the little strap going along the front and it is just so cute I love them so much you know I'm gonna be getting so much wear out of this it's such an easy piece to wear I feel like it's just gonna match everything which is really great okay I have two things left and they are kind of similar and the first one is a fountain pen and I am I'm actually so excited about this because I've been wanting one for a really long time but I can't seem to find the right one most of them are like plastic and I wanted something that looks a little bit more like vintage you know what I mean um, so this one actually comes in a little wooden case like look at that it's so pretty and then you open it and there's the fountain pen oh it's in the plastic wait so you open it like this and there's the fountain pen and it's all made out of like wood and it has gold accents and I just think it's so pretty and it looks like so fancy and I don't know I just I really like it and it looks a little bit more vintage than all the other ones that I was finding so not really sure where they found this the brand is Wardsworth and Black oh and it also comes with like little extra like ink cartridges so you can like replace it and stuff which is perfect last but not least like I said it is kind of similar and it is actually another fountain pen but this one actually has like the feather like you know those vintage ones that have like the big feather at the back and it has the little ink jar and I think it's so much fun and I've actually been wanting to try like a fountain pen that you dip into the ink like obviously the one that I just showed you that has the cartridges on the inside is more practical so that's more for like everyday use and this is more so for like special occasions obviously like how amazing is this pen and it also has different little tips so you can change it and it has a little stand as well so you can put it on like a desk or a dresser or something and it's just kind of like standing up like the feathers standing up I think it is so much fun I actually really love this it was really unexpected and something that I've actually haven't seen before so I'm not really sure where my mom got it or where my parents got it I should say um I don't really know there's not really a brand on it all it says is best design I don't really know to be honest but it comes in like this really cool box it has like pirate ships and stuff on it I don't know and yeah that pretty much wraps up this video I hope you guys liked it I hope you also have the most amazing wonderful Christmas ever um I have one more Christmas related video coming up it's gonna be my vlogmas week four which I actually filmed like all of Christmas and stuff yesterday I believe it's gonna go up on the 27th on the Sunday just because I have to edit this video today and I don't want to edit two videos today because I want to actually hang out with my family as well so it is gonna be going up on the 27th so make sure you guys are subscribed and turn on your post notifications so that you don't miss out on that video um and I'll see you guys next time bye Bye.